Are you picking at that poor boy's hair? I need to trim that. I missed it. <laughs> got that one long. <laughs> that is pretty big. Hey, you ready to go to Target? Yeah. Say, Super Target. Super Target. Super Target. Conveniently, the cart commander, forget Corral, they put up concrete blocks. But uh, they had one of these little uh, G wagons. I was all four of my children. This is a Target store brand Escalade. It's an escapade. Can we just clarify this now that we're only coming in here for one thing and one thing only? The Lego PD Piranha set? The Piranha plant? What? Shoes? Those black boots? No. Where's the big red balls that are outside of Target? You'd think they'd have big super red balls. I think if I just slowly walk away, she'll just like not realize that. Let's go. So when I was younger and freshly married, the ultimate we're not buying anything today move was just to walk off with the cart. Me thinking ahead, I'm like, well, if she don't have the cart, she can't really buy much because the only thing she can buy is the stuff she can hold and walk around with, right? Well, as marriage evolves, your wife eventually figures out she could just walk to the front of the store and get another cart. Then you end up buying more. Learn from me, Finn. So what I'm looking for looks like this, but in Lego. Look, like Amelia, it's Petey Piranha. So over here in the gaming section, we have the Lego NES and the Lego Atari, so we are on the right track. At first, I was like, look at this Star Trek poster, and then I seen the Spaceball ship. Oh, that's cool. Remember Duck Hunt on the original Nintendo? It's like a manual version of it with darts. I came in looking for Piranha Plant, and it's not here. If I make her carry them across the store, she'll change her mind. I expect the car up right there. Look! A new Disney castle. What's that from? It says Wish. I don't even know what Wish is. Before we go to the shoe aisle and we didn't find the piranha plant, can we just go? That was the one thing we came in here for. I mean, I guess. She said yes. We're out of here. This does not look like the shoes. Hey, what do you think this place is? The Catalina Super Target? Get out of there. You know what? I don't know any of these people up here in Indianapolis. These are all temporary to me. Oh, yeah. Why are you avoiding me? Why are you acting like we're not together now? Okay. Come back. No. You want these sequence shoes? No. You'll look like Cher. No. Well, I know you. I could be your Sonny if you're my Cher. I don't typically get involved in the decorating of my house, but we have a game room downstairs and uh, we're getting these pillows. Spider-Man and R2-D2. Doesn't have anything else on the other side though. And before you're like, you should check with your wife before you buy them, I did. Oh my word, it's a whole aisle dedicated to lacrosse water. If you're not a native of Indiana, they do sell St. Elmo's cocktail shrimp at the store. I know this looks like the piranha plant, but that's for me. We came in here for one thing and we didn't even get it. Can't get my boots. Nope, didn't have your size. Have size. That's all that. Put the kids in the car. <laughs> all right, I put the card up. What all do we have left? It's 5 30, so we got time to go to Hobby Lobby. I Lodi. love Super Target. What was so special about it? It's huge. It's hu I didn't have my boots in the size I needed, but it's phenomenal. Okay, so Crumble and Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. Okay. <laughs> Get in the van. We're here. Show me the goods. Show you the goods. Just oh. Show me the goods. Look at that, it's a churro donut. It's got that peach pie. It smells like diabetes. And, uh, it's got that uh, praline, peanut butter, brittle, oh. chocolate, cookie, churro, churro. Churro. All right, we made it. Oh no, it's a mecca Hobby Lobby. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Look how far the lights go back in the front. Oh my word, it's so big. They even put it next to a Kohl's. It's like the death trap. She hasn't seen it yet, but there's Party City right over there. Hey, watch out for the bell ringer. He looks like he's about to start a not for profit. I'm serious, man. The dude looks like he works part time at Starbucks. He knows what he's doing. Look at the shake and the stance. She doesn't stand a chance. I know this seems kind of redundant, but can you drive? All right, cool. So I was falling asleep and stuff. The one problem about these cars are specific is, is they're a little low getting in on the passenger side. 
so loud. It's the same on both sides. I just don't get in over here very often. Okay? I'm not a left ducker. I'm a right ducker. Okay. 